Okay. First spin. First spin in Essendon. We are still in round nine. Um, I think we're like halfway through it at this point. So, uh, hopefully. Oh, I'm trying to even think, like, did we have good games yesterday or were they blowouts? I think they were blowouts. But I was so, I remember I was so focused on, um, talking, uh, to who I had in chat that, uh, Staring each other down. that, um, <laughs> that I was somehow incredibly disconnected from what was happening in those games. But let's, let's come this way. Although that can actually be really, it can actually be really, it can be really nice. It's actually originally what I was preferring if I had like other things on my mind. It actually kind of works really well with the AFL game, I find. But we can have a problem like right there where I forget which controller is which team. That can, that, that can always be a problem. Um, coming this way. So naturally, I'll find myself pressing the same button with both controllers until like eventually I work it out. And they might get caught out here. Coleman, he set there we go. So we got come with the Essendon. You can't See if they can bring it in. They got it in. They get the this first shot. Aim. No. That could be a goal no. No goal there. They've I actually am really appreciating that it's a nighttime really game a for kick. us. Um, just because I felt like my eyes sort of just Great not up the things as perfectly as it could be. So having a nighttime game here McAdoo is actually really helpful. He's wrapped up. He'd like that one Come again. that way. This is no, off. get rid of that. From the front. Merit, okay then. Draper. Gonna be Mr. Now Draper. The I mean, over with Martin. He's okay, so I think the lighting is fine. I mean, it is daytime. Um, but I, had, I did decide to turn the light off. I, I don't think it's... I think it's good enough. I don't know. Um, coming in there. Mr. Shield. Oh, that's not great. Okay, well, we'll see how long it takes for one of the teams to score. Um, coming this way. I mean, preferably we wouldn't have it be like that BWS Sydney game we had like one or two rounds ago, where neither team can score a goal. Ridley making his claim for the um, they bring the handball back there. Collects the half volley. Good kick. Gardner with a big fist. Martin. Bring us this way. Let's see what you got. We got Mr. Gardner. So he, oh, damn. So we see the Essendons. You got Mr. Stringer, that comes in, and you got it to, oh, you got it to Langford. So one on one. Ah. This a goal. Should be a goal. Mr. Langford, so up to this point he has seven goals for the season. Um, okay, so that's almost won a game. Kicking Just under that. Okay, he doesn't even, that is an amazing pass. For the perfect start. That, don't, don't let anyone tell you that was a crap kick for goal, that was a great pass. Okay, Mr. Perkins should be able to have that, From he does pocket. get that. Looks good. Gets um gets the scoring on the way. Gets the scoring on the way. Okay, so we want to get rid of that. You want to uh, bring the pebble? You want to get you want to get it down there? Okay, great. In your fifty. Okay, so now Essen get another shot. This to make a good start, a very good one. Anthony. Okay, that's not going to make it either. But can it be a mark? Okay, it is, but it's Brisbane. So if he brings it out here, he might have thought about the corridor. will they be able to get it? Um, we, I, I still am trying to keep an eye on uh, the player one supremacy, which is just sort of what's, which is what I think is fully established at this point. Um, there was an idea of if it was a home team advantage or a first player advantage. Um, but ever since we've um. Ever since that we've been making the away team play one, the, uh, the away team's been winning I think, pretty much every time. The area. Rainer, so it's definitely a player one advantage. Um, going this way. The Gary is down on the Which I'm not even the type of person to really Thomas all that much be talking about like, oh my god, I understand that. games so well. Nick. Game design this Macadoo, and, and all and all those uh, and all the things, right? But if I hear like a there's a, like a clear play one advantage, I kinda think that's poor design. Come this way. Oh god no. Kelly doing the grunt work. Rainer. Uh, so it, it kind of it kind of makes it where in order to be it feels like in order for things to sort of be evenish we kind of have to try and help whatever is the second controller whatever team is controlled by that second controller so it kind of what it makes me want to try and do 
but I mean, I'm over here to talk. I, like as I'm as I'm going through it all, I just kind of forget. I tend to just kind of go with whatever flow was kind of got going on for the most part. is like the rock of Gibraltar. It's easy for me to sort of forget to do that, and then before you know it, we got a we got a blowout going. What's he got on offer? Go on here. Spud Frawley would have loved that one. Okay, that's with Brisbane. The handball doesn't get rid of it. They're going nowhere, and we'll have a stoppage near the center. Okay, let's see what we got that way. Go in here. Good tackle. Um, and you go out that way. Ashcroft. Mr. Ashcroft. I think it's on nine. And he is I uh, currently I just have it through my head just thinking about um, games being such they could, how they can be such a great distraction just from other things that you might have I've been thinking about I have had it um, in streaming where it, where they do sort of blend together uh, even it was a few days ago when I was where it just like where outside things really completely just took over um, like I know, ideally, I'm always I'm kind of wanting a blend in there where we're not just focusing completely on the game. Um, but at like a time right now, without um, like a time right now, just without, I might eventually go into detail on it. But um, it's nice. It's just nice having the game right here. Just have something. Just kind of enjoying going through it. Keep going there. I guess felt good. Um, we had we had the Crash Bandicoot right before this. That was a good time. Coming in here. Crunching tackle. Lays it off. McDonald Tipper. Oh. Uh, okay, get it out there. One thing I have, I have. We have. Okay, go that way. I've been trying to sort of limit Ruck's influence um, a little bit, just because. Uh, it can very, <laughs> these games can very easily be dominated by the Rock. I, I have noticed that, um, especially with the way I've been playing and like looking at the stats afterwards, it has been happening. Um, so <laughs> come this way. I mean, I try to, I try to have realism into the games if I can help it. But yeah, let's come this way. Got there. I think. Our attempts to make my attempts to get as many people involved as possible. I don't think we're doing a bad job at it. I still think it could be better. Um, but we'll see. Yesterday we had. Yesterday, maybe as well the day before, we just had a couple of games where it's like the team's getting demolished. Ended up just having. Um, ended up having players at the top of the disposal count which is uh and by like a large margin which it was definitely not what you ex expect to see but yeah who can get the clear let's see it come this way who you got there the okay so s and bring it back no there's gonna be lots of turnovers there's always lots of turnovers in our games bring it that way and lots of handballs always, always lots of handballs too big, too strong, too good. These half chances can often be the difference. That uh, that actually tends to be just because I'm trying to get It'll players involved. And I'm trying to get them towards a disposal there. count. Gets it to safety. So it kind of He's requires lots of little quick handballs. Martin. Usually. There we go. The attacking. Right. Is a beacon in that forward line. A straight kick here, and they'll be in front. Okay, so Peter Wright. He has himself 16. He had it. It was a few weeks ago where he had seven goals in the game. Um, that's online. It's, it does make the distance as well. So it gives Essen uh, the lead again. Gives them a two point lead here. So the underdog throwing down the gauntlet. You can see their belief grown. Dunkley. Bring it out, Mr. Ashcroft. Oh, okay, that's cool. And all that way. The kick's on there for him. Um, you're gonna run onto it. You do. Handball back made sense. Goes over towards Merritt. You kick down there. Bring yourself in here. Okay, that's a nice intercept. Get the kick back there. It works enough. Handball's over. Kick over. Oh! Okay, a little smother by him. A little smother by a guy. Go this way. See who you got. Uh, there's another opportunity. 
Little kick. You've got a stringer. Okay. He has himself 11 goals on the season. I think uh, at the end of the season, when we're looking at the common medalist, the amount of goals scored, we could have. It could be not only a good race, but we could have uh, quite a few people. I think potentially in. Could we have people in the 70s? We might. I feel like we should have quite a few people in the 50s and 60s. I was actually just trying to think about the top goal scorers I remember kind of thing. That's something we can check eventually. I think when we hit like halfway through the season, so after round 11, we'll probably have a have a look at the top stat getters, see how things are looking. Go this way. But we're still a while away from that. Bring us in here. Oh, is that Mr. Shields? Is that online? Oh, we got that. Oh, thanks. So, Essen, they come in. They get their fourth goal for the quarter. Gives them a 14 point lead. Where's that one? That's Essen in. Move over. And the kick comes in. Gets only to Essen in, though. Out wide with the kick, the Bombers having a great patch. Takes the logical option. Down the line. Ball. The Redman. wing, it gets over to Redman. Uh, you might want to chip it over there. He doesn't waste many. Martin. Just waiting Into for the, the middle. To press Comes goal. over with Perkins. Perkins. You go it. Okay. Well, Peter Wright Blast. comes onto it. Can you get that goal? For a second goal that today. is offline, I think. He'll have to wait. He's missed. That it is. So Danny Rich brings it in for finish. Brisbane. Rich brings it back in. Our man the over here does mark the ball. It's always a good sign. That's a good option. Um, and this looks promising. To see, Takes the short see that both teams have Rapper. interest in actually Manages playing the game. Good ball. to see. But uh, when we end the first quarter, Essen ended up being on the run. Uh, that second half of the quarter there. You have to help them uh, not only get the lead, but have a decently the uh, after the first quarter too. They're already playing catch up. The scoreboard damage isn't enormous though, and a good second quarter can get this game back on the by Oh, that's with Brisbane. It all starts no, nope, never mind. Okay. Sure they give their forwards the best oh, they're just the playing. Okay, so we're just going back and forth. Can I get rid of that? It does that kick does come out of there? Coming the rest. Oh, that's down the floor. That's come off the instep. So a lot of uh, quarter scores is going on right there. The Lions not at their best so far. McCluggage. Um, alright then, that is coming, is that going to come out? Mr. Kelly, okay, so it's coming back, a little kick out here that goes over to Rich, he can go, he can bring it down, keeps it going, oh, well we got like, this man really ran out of bounds so he could come get that, that was kind of amazing, handled that way, oh damn, uh, who has it, that's Mr. Merritt, the Bombers are bringing great energy. Gardner. Yes, they are. He stopped in his track. At Coleman, I think Coleman. it will be. The little kick Clever goes over. Kick. Comes with Rich. Rich. Um, just bump it down there. The See what you got. This goes into the middle. The little pack fight. going. Parish. Comes with the Bombers. Go up this way. Okay, you got Setterfield. It's can over there. Their confidence growing. Leaves it behind. Um, Martin wins a hard ball. I think he bring it here. That. Over that's with Brisbane. He he, okay, it? no. Well, that's not like him. But we'll see. Redmond, we'll see if uh, Brisbane Hamburg, can make a little comeback in here. Wilmot. I mean, it's not looking. It's not, look, it's not too bad at the moment. Um, the best thing got a few. Got like the next couple of goals. Uh, then we definitely got to look. Got to be. Got to be worrying a little bit about the competitiveness of this game. And they're away. They should have been going forward. Now Girls there. And uh, seeing a Brisbane forward not wanting to mark the ball. Definitely a concern. Come this way. Bring it over there. Can you get the goal in that? Oh, damn. Okay, then. That's, uh... No. Lots to analyse, Gaz. What stands out? The Lions aren't getting much value out of their clearance dominance. And that can be very deflating. Oh, this way. That's Neil. That can be a goal. That can be a goal. There you go, baby. Hey, he's got that. Okay, with the Brahmins, what you want to get here? What it's you want to get there? Ball, but not gonna get it. You ever played darts? I, I kind of, I'm just having this, I, I, just, I was just like remembering how like 
years ago I had like a dart board and actually spent time like practicing darts in there. Part of me like actually is kind of hoping if I was to look around I'd actually be able to find it. But I just had that pop in my head. I actually, in terms of um, presentation of, of sports, I actually think darts is really good. Just in that they have like with the 180. I think that's amazing. It fell into his arms. Come in this way. The Lions have denied the um, Quality delivery by foot. Go there. The okay, so who you got? You got Colbo. I feel like at first glance, thinking of dots, it, I, I feel like it shouldn't be as popular as it is. <laughs> I actually feel like the presentation of having, like, you have um, the announcer, and you have, and then, and the, and all, and like, I, I kind of, because I can't even necessarily think. There you go. There you go. I can't even necessarily think too much about like when it comes to darts and I think about what's in my memory like what do I remember I can remember at times um, of like perfect games but then um, it's mostly like what I remember is 180 and then they play the music and then the crowd's going along with it you know like the experience of it all the Bombers have certainly looked a bit of Coming in there with Langford. I think they've got like, a, I think that they've got like a great experience that they've put forward, like atmosphere, you know? But that's going to be a goal. Few heads will start to drop soon if they can't turn the tide. They're right on the edge. The Lions will need to respond. It's being put to them. Dunkley Bring it over there. Him down. Um, who do you want to get it to? That's Mr. Bailey. To work with. Can he and that's all. Go out there. It's no place for the there you go. Artists. It's been so long since I actually seen anything of dark. <laughs> I don't even know. Like I don't even know what the full landscape is whatsoever of it. It's, it's, I like. It just kind of popped in my head. But it felt good. It felt good to think about that. You have like little nice memories that just pop in your head for seemingly no reason. It's nice. Okay, so Mr. Apple's come down here. He's got a go. Um, well, we're at, we're at 26 points. It's only halfway through the second. So, it's definitely time for Brisbane. But that play one supremacy is definitely showing itself. Goes in there. He's gonna get the mark. I wanted you to get a mark. Ow, my ow. Isn't it weird, though, thinking of, like, darts, how, like, the highest score is in the bullseye? But just, that, that's... I will say that when it comes to darts, the fact that a bullseye isn't the highest sport feels counterintuitive. That feels that, that feels wrong. Come this way. I'll go down there. Um, bring it out over here. Let's see what you got. You go that way. This is a big opportunity. The Lions need to make inroads soon. Bring to the right. I wonder how dots. I don't know. Now suddenly I want to like find out what the like when dots even originated. Like who even came up with the idea of let's make like a little. Like I feel like archery would have started first. I feel like there's a good chance because there's definitely similarities between dots and archery. Um, I feel like archery probably would have come first. And okay, come in this way. And maybe they're like people who just like wanted to play archery. Maybe it was raining. They felt like they couldn't do it, so they they wanted to try and find like an indoor version of archery, which is just what darts became. Perhaps. I don't know if that's how accurate that is. Come in here. There's another handball out there. That's with McGrath. You get the kick down. Stays with Fessen then. Inside, comes over with Parrish. They've worked it well. How's the entry? Right, displaying great endeavor. Um, who's that with? We'll get rid of that. Cops some unwanted attention. He's besieged. The umpire says he made an attempt to get it out. McInerney looking for territory. Go that way. No, inside the middle. Let's see what you got. That's with Rainer. Now you want to go with the Brisbane still? Okay. He's run into trouble. I'll go out there. Oh no. That's poor play. Brisbane that way. Go here. With, okay, so that's Barry. Who's that coming with? Into the 50. Can Brisbane get a mark in here? They can't. But can they get the crumb? No. Okay, it's a nice tackle. Keeps it inside the 50. The ump gives him the benefit of the doubt. 
Who can get the clearance? McCluggage. Oh, that could have been a free kick. Could have been a free kick to Essendon there. Now she come. Oh, that's lucky Neil. Neil. Okay, then that's going to be a ball up there. I was um, I keep having it in my mind. So there's like a game that that uh that comes out soon, like within within a couple of days, which is the um AUW uh Fight Forever game. And I keep keep thinking, oh, I want to get that game. I want to get that game. I I think I am going to be getting it. Um, <laughs> I realized I went. I have no idea what I'd be doing from there was. I, I realized that, and I was like, ah, oh, that's it, that's the thing I'm going to have to work out if I'm getting it. But part of me is like actually thinking that the game would be fun for me to play. Come this way. There is a hesitation in me to get it, um, but, okay, come this way. But like, I remember enjoying my wrestling games in the past. It's been a, it's been a long time since I played one. Um, and it just, it looks very arcadey, which is really nice, so, come that way. So it's kind of been making me want to get it and play it. Oh, come on. But of course we'll be keeping, oh, keeping our regularly scheduled AFL games going. Since we started, we, we are looking to continue to go through the whole season. There's definitely no plans to stop that. That's unusual. Um, that see what we got here. He would have been I, up I am, I have been a little bit curious on, um, the improvements on this game. In that, um, I, I feel like there is a way to kind of work that out. And that would be if I was like to go back to like the early rounds when we started here and details that weren't actually present to actually see like a clear difference of the improvement of the game i'm not going to do that though i'm not going to do it it just sounds like a good idea <laughs> okay, come this way do what you got there dunkley they need to be able to get a goal on here it's over there that just comes with mcgraw though gets rid of it Mops that one up. Essendon, clear the ball. Oh, that's not 15. He ran into a brick wall. Their appeals have fallen on deaf ears. Mackin got a little stuff there. Mr. Berry. Berry. He'll get rid of that. Near. Oh, you could have had, you had that person out of here. Oh, that's not over. it. That's not the handball you wanted. They're going to get a mark. Hasn't it very well. That's a point. Laverde, taking no chances. And finally over the line. Ridley, in you come, in. over with Harry. So let's um, let's bring it in the middle here. The, oh, oh, dude doesn't want to mark it. Oh, come this way. Here we go. It's Brisbane. Puts his teammate under the pump. Set of field. Oh, no, that's uh, one of these teams eventually has to be able to get clear. Has to be able to get a clearance. They might be a little unlucky not to be rewarded. It was a fine tackle. McAnooney, the winner there, Caldwell, managed to okay, get come this way. Oh no, oh no, Let's see what you got, that is with, that's with us in there, oh, he might have done better. I'm on, oh okay, they can get this, Jolly you can get this, yeah, there you go, there you go, we got a minute, we got a minute to go now, that's going to be with Essen. they can get, no they're not going to get that one, um, Oh, with Brisbane in the 50 here. They got one more chance. They got another chance at it. Ah, uh, that comes down. Danaher. Oh! They can get... They can... What have they got? That's, a, that's gonna be... Oh, okay. It's gonna be a ball up. There's 20 seconds left. One last chance for Brisbane here. They got it. Can they get rid of it? Oh! Ball up. There won't be time. I know it's a six seconds, but... We play 10 minute quarters, so it's only 3 seconds, there won't be time. <laughs> See what I mean there? We've hit the long break, and it's a handy margin, but by no means... I was going to like, take a little bit break, this but part of me, um... Uh, Let's head down to okay. Gary on the ah! The bombers threw I was going to take a break, but part of me was suddenly thinking about like quiz shows, and trying to work out what is it about like certain quiz shows that gives them like longevity and all that stuff because i think i'd be literally i'm just going to be thinking about it on the spot right now um because i had like this australian show pop in my mind which was called temptation um i remember that when i was a kid that would have been uh holy crap that would have been like 
uh, that honestly might have been like 15 plus years ago when that actually came out. But it, it was it was just like a lot of quiz shows end up being pretty similar. It's just like the way like it's like why does Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Why is that the, why is that one of the shows that um has the longevity it has? Um, I'm sure part of it's like like the thing that's always great about quiz shows of why they can be popular is that the audience themselves are able to play at home. That's always part of it. Um, okay, there you go. To make it effectively a five goal game. I also just realized I don't think that, I don't even know if the price is right is something that came towards Australia in terms of Australia having their own price is right. I think there's a very good chance it did. Um, I'd have to look that up. But um, let's see what we got here. But it never was like the, the mainstay. It was like it's, it's, it's that it that it was in um, America. Come to oh. Right yeah, that's holding the ball for sure. Bring it that way. Coming. Okay. Um, let's They're see. Let's see what we go Tom. this way. Somehow Out there. The ball. The bombers have all the answers. Anytime I think Is of like quiz shows, I immediately start right. thinking of Family Feud. Like, I don't know if Family Feud to really has been in Australia. I don't think it is at the moment. I think... Oh, that's not... I I don't think it is at the moment. I know that there was... Um, it was around even just a couple years ago. Perkins. Don't think it is at the moment. But I'm still like, I'm still upset that it's not like accessible or that like the American version. I'm still like upset it's not like easily accessible. You know. Come play with the stringer. Because I know I would have watched so much more Family Feud then. Um, isn't like Jeopardy all on like Netflix or something? I think that might be true. Like almost like during COVID or something, like Netflix or someone was like buying a bunch of Jeopardy episodes. Which Jeopardy can be like fun play and stuff, but very quickly learn. Um, yeah, no, I'm, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not good enough. <laughs> I'm not good enough for that. Okay, come out there. Keen to get this ball forward. Uh, that's gonna go out of bounds. It wasn't the best kick, and we'll have a throw in. The Lions need to come hard pretty soon. It's in danger of getting away from them here. McAdoo punches it out. Okay, go this way. It's no place for the faint heart. Um, but yeah, like most of these quiz shows and stuff, most of them just like last what, like maybe two seasons at best. Most of them just come and go and all that. Um, it's like why, why do the why did the like good ones stick around? I know that we got um Ah, uh, what the fuck is it called? What the chase? Like I know that the chase has been around for a, a long time in there. There you go. Um, like I guess like part of why that would still stick around is the competition. Like there's a competition element in there. Come this way. Like you're you're competing against the chaser. Come this way. But his kick is a stride. <laughs> but that wouldn't be the same as he wants to be a millionaire. He wants to be a millionaire. Although, um, there is a competition element. At least with the Australian version. I'm not sure how it is. The other ones. Where they got, um, um, like a little quiz beforehand. And, and like, stuff. Like real quick questions beforehand. And then they do the, like, the hot seat. Get. <laughs> um, but yeah, come this way. Man, I actually that actually just started popping in my mind, remembering how there was actually a millionaire, like an Australian version, a millionaire. Oh, video game. Um, but it was like DVD version, I think. Um, come this way out there, and then I, I like I just had this like memory in my head of playing it with like brothers and sisters, coming this way. I actually think one time we might have actually gone to the millionaire. I think we might have one time. Lots to analyze, Gaz. What stands out? The Lions haven't had many avenues to go. It might be worth sending a midfielder or even a defender forward to try to create a favorable matchup. Caldwell, crunching tackle. Oh, okay. Good handball. Starsevich, cops some unwanted attention. Parish. Oh, I do not. In theory, the idea of going on a show like Who Wants to Be a Millionaire sounds really fun. Going on a quiz show, in theory, sounds really fun. But I feel like you'd have to be prepared to go through like a year or even maybe two years of like preparation of just like getting general knowledge and you'd just be like watching a lot of things beforehand. I feel like there would be a lot of preparation you'd have to do beforehand for something like that. Um, coming this way. That's going to be a ball up. But we'll have a stoppage. 
Punch clear. Um, hopefully Brisbane here can get a couple of goals, make it a bit closer. Knew the tackle was coming. Leave some suspense on who could win. That would be fun. That would be great. I'm not even sure how many goals have been scored this quarter. I've been too busy talking about quiz shows. Come that way. Um. Oh! Incorrect disposal. Okay, come bring us this way. That's an impressive. That's with Mr. Kelly. Who was he aiming for? Um. Well, this guy, obviously, Mr. Caldwell. Well drilled, Perkins. Bring me in there. Drives it inside the forward fifty. Okay, so that's going to be Peter Wright. His opponent and took a ripper to push the margin beyond thirty. Yeah, that could be good. Uh, Mr. Wright, and that's going to be. That won't make the distance. Wiedemann oh, okay, Andrew get rid of that. Get Moving rid of that one. Laterally. Is that coming back? No. Terrific okay, well, it's going to stay in the 50. No and have the ball up. And they've got a stoppage in a dangerous position. I do wonder, like, I remember, um, oh, I actually think I kind of, now suddenly it's, I'm finding myself wanting to, like, after I finish stream, look up videos of, like, players who managed to, like, beat quiz shows, or, like, just quit, beat, like, uh, game shows, and, like, I know I would have, like, been interested in, in that before, or, like, think that, or, if, like, where they either cheat it, or they just find a way to, um, I find a way to like break it, you know. That, like that can always be fun. Like I remember hearing about um guy. I don't even remember what this game was. Um, oh god! But there was a dude who like put so much research into. Uh, I really wish I could remember the name of the show, but it was like back in like the 70s or 80s. He got like a bunch of B8, um, which is always a thing. Like um, for me in Australia when I hear um, the American term being like VHS where like yeah I just know it as like VCR um, I don't coming this way I don't even think I've ever learned what those letters actually stand for I'm just guessing the V is like video or visual one of those um, come this way that's no mark oh it's over come on come on come on you got to oh no he ran into a brick See what you got this way. Oh god damn. But maybe like when we finish this quarter we could actually we could actually look up what that thing was. Oh my god, that was a goal, holy crap. But I just remember that being a dude who just like got onto like um a show that and then he just like got so much money from it. He's got so much that they that it's like um them actively how, the, how then the show has to like change the rules or they have to, they have to find a way to like change things around to try and stop that person i remember hearing i'm not talking about jeopardy with um james uh whatever his last name was it's like with an eight um but like he was getting a bunch of money because of the way he was playing and it was it was fascinating to hear the theory that the reason that jeopardy tried getting rid of him based on not actually making the game harder but it was actually by making the game easier and then like everyone knew the answers so then he wouldn't have like actually have an advantage like that's a fascinating idea like because usually you're like hey let's like make game because you would think if you want to like stop someone you can make it harder and not so the other way around but that's actually amazing to think about that psychologically if you actually want to stop someone having dominance um that's like really that's like a lot better than other people you actually just make what you, 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 you just make things easier for everyone just has to hit a target Rich takes an excellent grab. Suddenly, there's some belief about them. I just realised it's only 15 points. Normally delivers. Good Bring us this way. Good execution. Comes with McDonald, Tip and Woody. He goes in the 50. Will he go the bomb? Um. Oh, hey! Carl Langford gets to the front spot. This is what he gets paid to do: kick these goals. Okay, so we'll come with Carl Langford. See if he can get this goal in here. That, oh wow! Don't tell me he's missed. Gee, I expected him to get that, that one. Definitely expected him to get cheers. that one. Coleman to bring it in. McKenna with a big Okay, fit. that's gonna be a and throw a in. For the players to catch their breath. Lots to analyze, Gary. What stands out? Well, this isn't the best standard game so far, but the contest, it's thoroughly enjoyable. Lions. Neil. Good use of hands. It's done clear the kicks on there. Keeps it low. It's not 15, okay. So you've got to keep it going. 
McInerney. This is that comes up. over with Wilmot. That goes in the 50. The defenders will um, be nervous. See what you Who's can get. Nothing quite there. Bailey. Go at. Oh, dang. Okay, Bailey that's not great. Out on the floor. A chance to clear now. Durham has a fast like grip. Shield can keep it moving. They're now you come this way. You come with Redman. Redman. That goes He's into the middle of with Tipper. Tip and Woody has found some space. He's been quiet. Parrish. Okay, so what we got? We got two minutes left. Just under two minutes to go. Um, we'll see if Essendon can get potentially another goal in here. They get the ball there. No. I think there's a kick option out there. Okay. There's a handball. Um, just kick it down there then. What you got? Comes with Essendon. Kicks into the 50. No one. Get rid of that. Oh no. Uh, you got Essendon in there. Come, someone who's going to get that one. That's with Brisbane. Still with Brisbane. They keep the handballs going. They get the kick in there. I think that's through Wilmot. Oh! Oh my god. Oh my goodness. That's another goal. It's only a 10 point game now. This is exactly what we've been wanting. Oh my god. Could they get another one in here? They go down again. They go down there again. Okay, they won't get it there. They won't get it there. Uh, but we'll be back. We'll come back in just a little moment. We're going into the last quarter with Essen having a 10 point lead. Okay, so we're back here. We are back with the last quarter. Um, we got a 10 point game. Nice and close. We'd like to see that. Um, I decided, like, in my, like, little, what, it ended up being, like, 30 seconds of stretching, or something like that. I ended up actually just trying to do a quick YouTube search for, like, 80s game show. So, it was actually, what I was talking about was actually a show called Pressure Lock. Um, where it was being a dude who was, um, he, he, he had gotten a bunch of VHSs, um, oh, whatever. And he was just, like, studying the show. He would have gotten a bunch of recordings, and then he would have noticed that the show itself had a predictable nature. In terms of where they were putting like little bonus stuff, so he kind of knew kind of where to where to go with everything. I think that's kind of what he had worked out, and he went on like this massive run. Coming out that way. All right, have you ever heard of like the dude who's who's like a who was like a serial killer who went on a dating show? <laughs> I remember hearing about that, and, like seeing stuff on that. Come this way. Oh wait, actually, I'm just trying to think. I think, um, because he was on a dating show and he actually won the dating show. It was like a, um, I don't actually, oh, what was it called? I can't remember what it was called. Like, I remember what the, sh what the show was. Because it was like, it was the woman and she had like three bachelors or whatever that she had to choose from, but she couldn't see them. She was asking them questions. I don't remember what it was called. Um, come this way, Essendon. But he was actually the guy that he went to choose and would have gone on a date on. But it was like, I'm pretty sure she said that she felt like uncomfortable um so she actually never went on it which had she she probably would have gotten killed i remember i remember seeing that it go that way coming with starsevich uh let's see what she got no Campbell out that way. Yeah, there was someone there. I knew there was someone there. Get rid of that one. Oh, that's turned over. Can give them some drive off halfback. That's an uncharacteristic mistake. Um, so that comes over here. That is Mark. Now he can bring it into. Okay, I think that's coming back. Redman showing why he's such a good defender. Doesn't often waste it. Get the kick over there. That's with Caldwell. Um, bring it down there. Outside. Who you got? Redmond. Base with Essen then. The kick in. Comes of the Peter Wright. Alright then. Oh! Neil wins it back. Oh, a vine. He's given it oh, that's a nice tackle. Opposition. I probably should have been a free kick, but not to be. Gets in the way. Get rid of that. That's Dylan Shiel. Comes inside. Oi! Oh. Mr. Merritt! Jack Merritt! Oh, that's post. They've got to start making these opportunities count. He's off. Uh, we got Coleman go over this way. Who you got? Oh, uh, you got Martin. See what you got? Ah, oh, dang, you got Heppel. Okay, okay, actually, that's a good thing for Essen. Oh, my mind's just out of it a little bit right now. Okay, then. So, 
Apple comes in. I mean, he tried. He definitely tried to miss it. But he got it. Brings us to 17. It'll be very difficult for Brisbane, especially if uh, Essen get this next one. I kind of feel like Brisbane probably need the next one to keep their chances of winning. The Lions will have one eye on the clock. Especially how it's not particularly easy to just go and just get goals. Corbwell cops some unwanted attention. Neither side able to clear the footy. Rucks go at it. Get up for Brisbane. Cluggage. They get the He'll clearance in here. Go. He's gone. Come get rid of that. Come get rid of that. Durham. That's Mr. Durham. Can you get that in? Uh, yeah, yeah, that's helpful again. Well, he's already got at least one. I he think he might actually have two to this point. Uh, I can't. It doesn't tell me how many goals he's got. But Heppel comes in. There we go. He's got that one too. Well, I think that's uh, he's got two goals in a row for Heppel. I think so. So it gives him a 23 point lead. I was saying Brisbane probably needs the next one. But Brisbane are going to win. They, they do still have time. They do still have time. But from this point, it's definitely not going to be easy. That's going to be a throw-in, I Kicks imagine. Yeah. And out of bounds. The Bombers haven't nailed the door shut yet. They'd love the next goal. Draper palms it down. See what you got there. It's a hot footy. Um, bring it. Oh. Okay, so he's taken there. And it is. Durham. Comes with Brisbane. They, I kind of feel like they the kind of have to be ready now. to just go for it at this point. Um, they're going to get the ball here. Lions. It's a Lions. You want to, That's going to be holding the ball. That's going to be, yeah. The lift door's closed on him and he's gone. That's skillful. Set a field. Bring the kick this way. It's a high ball. That is with. That stays with Essen. Apple's been very big in this Good quarter. Kick. Barry. Yeah, but he turns that one over. And can that, was a, that was a really important intercept right the there by Barry. Comes down, Dunkley. comes over with Brisbane. To Coming to get the ball. McKenna. Okay. He and then that's going to be a ball up so we're halfway through Brisbane need four goals they're going to win with a deft come that way Paris. they're going to need at least four goals if they're going to win Durham, he just um that's with Danny Rick back with oh uh okay Essen no Brisbane comes with Danny Rich again I think oh that's a turnover he'll be dragged if he keeps doing that Takes the come out this way option. the kick's McGraw. over there who you got? Well it's less with Durham. Handball it over. Kelly. You bring it down. Let's see what Heads you got. That's, an impressive That's Apple again. In the 50. You can see their and that is with. Oh, no mark. Over that way. Who you got? Oh, is that Heppel again? Bryce and Heppel. Oh, he's missed that one. Oh, he missed that one. Damn. I feel like that would have like, almost sealed it, pretty much. Oh, over the top. Dunkley, what are y'all doing? It's, I mean, Brisbane, Castle. what are y'all doing there? You had, you had, like, the option. You had the opportunity right then. That's 24 points. That is an even four goals. Has tirelessly. Paris. So Brisbane can, can still wall. come back. We'll they can make it interesting. Ball. They could even still potentially win. Um, but they're probably going to need to get a move on. They're going to need to get a move on real quick. Yeah. Okay, that's out of there. Who's got that? That is in the 50. It, coming. Oh, doesn't come out. Oh, okay, that comes with Essendon. And Hamble out there. Coming over with Redman. He gets that to Sir Thatcher. Coming back here. You've got to go in. Got to go in. Big mark for Essendon. Oh, no, 15. Pressure, keeps okay, so it comes over with McDonald's differently. Handball's over to Draper. Draper. That comes into the 50. That's a nice kick for him. Um, especially with the going out. And we'll have a throw Waste some time on the clock. Lots gets him in gets in territory. Now, the Bombers will take a lot of belief from this, not only because of the win, but the way they've gone about it. They put plans in place and executed. And... Perkins. Oh! That's got to be it. There. That's got to be it there. A goal there for Essendon, pushes it to 30, 5 goals, it's only 7 minutes left. Coming in there, who are you going to get? But coming over with Brisbane, they got to get rid of that. Um, okay then, we got, we got a ball up here, we got under 7 to go, 6.45. 
five goal game. Uh, mathematically, still possible for Brisbane, but these last few minutes, Essendon have been ones to take advantage of the situation. Coming in there. Okay. Got to kick that out. You got to go. Kicks to a contest. Neil just had to get it out. Ridley, have to get it out. You have to. Okay. So who's that coming to? got in the way. You might want to get rid of that, dude. Like, why are you? Why are you stopping? We didn't have to stop in there. You need to keep running through. Um, going that way. The Caldwell. Oh. Coming with Martin. Into the middle. Can't afford to give it back in the corridor. Turns it over in the middle. Merritt. Zach Merritt. They've got winners all over the park. Stasevic takes an excellent grab. That's good vision. I know that Brisbane need to go forward, but the this dude was there by himself. So I felt like it made Ridley sense in that situation. Happy to be patient and wait for an opening. That yep. doesn't travel far enough. That is 15 Headball. over there. Do you want to bring it there? Durham. That's another mark. Amble it over. It comes to Heppel again. He gets it to McDonald to Pony. Apple is definitely the MVP of this quarter. That is that is absolutely for sure. It's a tough game. Okay, yeah, well that's holding the ball. They got four minutes. Can, what can Brisbane do in four minutes? just shoveled it out. Dunkley. Not much, apparently. The umpire will have it. I got a ball up on that. Um, I thought I could have been holding the ball. Punch clear. Uh, you might want to get rid of it. No, that's with Essendon. Bring that out. That's with Setterfield. He gets the kick going. Coming over to McDonald's to Moody. He gets that one. Um, I'm going to bring it out. Bring it in the 50. That's with... Oh, that's... Okay. No one gets that one. Hey, what are you, you all doing there? Okay, just kick it. Comes into the 50. And there's no mark for that. Coming back out. Comes with Brisbane, though. Comes with Brisbane. So they get it towards the square. Can they get a mark? Okay, so they'll get something here. They'll get a little something here. Jack Gunston will come back. He'll get his second. Um, They'll bring it to 24. That's what, what it does there. So. Essendon will get the victory. Essendon will get the win here. Um, it's just a matter of how much. Barry, oh wow! It's no place for the faint heart. Um, they put themselves under pressure. Who's coming to get that? That's going down there. No mark. It's a desperate that coming out. Gathers. Oh, got, got Draper there. Um, handball that way. Keep it going. That's Mr. Merritt. The little they kicks on, comes over to Heppel, handball it back, that comes with... Okay, so now it's with Merritt again, it's under a minute to go. Brisbane go in the 50 here, they got that intercept. They don't get the mark, that was kind of hurt, there was definitely an opportunity there. Um, oh, see what you get. And you're gonna get rid of that? It doesn't get rid of it, so it's gonna be holding the ball, which is giving Gunston one more opportunity. The end of the game here. Final siren sounds. Gunston last shot of the game. Should kick the goal now and he gets the goal. The the is okay then. So. We'll see these little stats here. See who's at the top of it. It was Gunston who ultimately had three goals. Um, Heppel, yeah. Three goals for Essendon. That makes a lot of sense. Um, okay, so you see Parrish and Neil here who are at the top 42. See those marks, those Essendon players at the top as well there. So, Essendon get this victory over Brisbane. They had three goals through Dyson Heppel. Uh, they had 42 from Parrish leading the way. And they get over the top of Brisbane, 76, 58, and uh, 18 point victory.